Why does nobody use this crazy Natara team? But what you do get is this setup. <laughs> and just like that, it's just GG's. It's <laughs> all right what is going on everybody it is your boy bounty here back with some more natara action like always and uh, just before we get into this video i just want to thank you all so much for the recent support on my last video that i ended up making because that ended up being uh one of my most popular videos that i uploaded in such a short amount of time the only other video that came close to when it initially dropped when i initially made the upload is actually my advanced natara guide that i ended up making which has almost 7k views which is actually like it's absolutely insane the amount of support that you guys are giving me so i just wanted to get that out of the way real quick as i said in my last video please make sure you like and subscribe to the channel i would really appreciate the support because i'm going to be making more types of videos like this and also i am going to be live streaming i don't know if i did say that in my last video but you can follow me at a uh, bounty underscore hunter i'll be streaming every monday wednesday and friday and uh, along with my additional youtube content i'll be doing that completely separate but yeah if you want to have some viewer matches with me i would definitely love to play with you guys or if you just want to come into the chat and just chill i would just greatly appreciate that as well but enjoy the matches all right let's go we get this oh hold on. is this the same guy that i fought hold on we'll wait because i could have swore this name reminds me of this uh hold up because I'm like real conflicted now. I think this is the same guy I fought in my Lee May video now that I'm looking at the name. Because I was going to be like, oh, it's a, it's a, it's an Omni-Man player. I was like very excited. But like now seeing the name actually is kind of like, it's like a neuron activation. Like that meme of like, <laughs> of like the monkey meme. I don't know if anybody knows what I'm talking about. Where it's just like a, a monkey for some reason. And like he sees a photo and like his brain just activates. It's so good. It just reminded me of that for some reason. I don't know why. It's kind of like random. But yeah, I guess that's the best way I can explain it. I don't know. Let me see. Oh, yeah. Let's see what he got. Oh, no. That is a punish, sir. All right, cool. Let me just do this. Bam, bam. Nice. And I got the side switch to... Uh, I swear, I swear, I swear. Once I get started with this character, it's going to be death. Watch this. Oh, yeah. You're dead. You are dead. Look at this damage. Bam, bam, bam. Look at this. Oh, no. I dropped it. You got to be kidding me. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I still did 400 on a drop combo. And then watch this. Oh, no. That would have hit. No, I try to dash. Okay, that's fine. It's all fine. You see, this is the difference between using a 30-minute character in the lab versus somebody that you actually, like, main. It's actually insane, the difference. He's going to have to break because if not, he is going to die. Okay, nice. Watch this. Then he's going to go here. He's going to wake up with something. All right, now you're dead. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, whoa. He broke. All right, cool. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I could have swore I blocked I could have swore. Oh no! Give me this. Hold on. Let me see if I can hit the cool stuff. Bam, 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 bam. Here. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Okay, this one. All right. Game one quickly ends super fast. Oh Jesus! All right. Cool. Let's see. Let's see what kind of adjustments he's gonna do for the second game. Gonna jump maybe? No, not quite. Oh, I tried to air dash through. I couldn't even air dash through. Okay, that's fine. But yeah, for sure, I honestly believe that this is the guy in my Lee May video who just absolutely destroyed me. Can I just go for a low? Yeah, I can. All right, cool. Let me just go for a knockdown because I'm going to switch to Melina soon. And I could do this. Nice blocks. Very smart, very smart. Ooh, unfortunate. Let me do this. Nice. Poke. Backdash. Oh, I caught him out on the bluff. Nice poke. Ooh, this guy's very patient, very patient. I like it, though. I like it. Whoa, hold up. Did that just go through him? Did that just go through him? Hold up. Oh, that's a dive to punish. Nice. All right, cool. Wake up. No, not quite. Let me do this. Nice. Nice throw. Very smart. Very smart. I'm trying to play like a maniac right now, but it's okay. Okay, very smart. Okay. Oh, man. I got way too ahead of myself. I'm getting way too excited because I like it finally clicked that this is the guy that I fought in my uh, Lee May video. Let me just trade down too. All right, nice. Wake up. Oof. The reads. Did anybody see that? I knew. He was going to challenge with the high, so I was like, you know what, let me just challenge with a uh, very quick micro duck, and let me just go for my uh, standard 1-2-1-2 two, two punish, so that's going to be really good. Let me go for here, watch this. Oh man, you got to be killing me. Oh no, okay, that's fine. Nice. Let me come here. Nice. Wake up. Yeah, I knew he was going to wake up. I literally caught it too, Ugh, and it would dive kick. All right, going on to the potential last game for the first ever guy that we're going up against so this is good nice plus frames overhead nice blocks let me just go here delay slightly bam just ended off with a very simple knockdown so i could come from here nice he's gonna have to break if he doesn't break he's dead yeah okay very smart 
Nice challenge. Okay, nice. Come over here. Smart. If you do it, you're dead. Smart. Going for the 2-2 two -two overhead. Okay, I like it. I like it. I like it. What is it going to be? Go for a knockdown, maybe? Nice. Smart. Oh, no. That's death. Hold up. That is death, my friend. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. Look at this damage. Look at this damage. Oh, my goodness gracious. And then go for a knockdown. Get my EX blood sacrifice. There's nothing he could do in this situation. Absolutely nothing he could do in this situation. Because the EX blood sacrifice takes life from you even when you're blocking. And because in that situation, it was a chip kill guarantee. Ooh. How do we get a Shang? Shang Motaro. Interesting. I've... It's been a while since I've seen like any of these crazy teams, if I'm being really honest. All right, cool. Gonna go for a spike. Okay, plus frames. Oh, I try to go for my EX. Nice, very good. All right. See, in a matchup like this, I kind of just have to be patient, which is very scary because... Oh, no. He's gonna have to break. Oh, no, he's not gonna break. Look at this damage. Ladies and gentlemen, look at the damage on the top left corner. Look at this. Look at that. 400 just off of nothing. And I get a free blood sacrifice. Yeah, and it's done. Look at that. So easy, so clean. I don't even have to do anything crazy. And I got the Molina again. Let me just do this. Probably going to jump. Oh, nice. Very smart. Let me just play a little bit of a uh, neutral a little bit. Just trying to get a little bit of my space. and go for a throw. All right, nice. I got my throw out. It's going to be a lot of damage because it is the J throw. So it's going to be about 130. Okay, nice. Probably going to go for low. Give me back dash. Oh, no. Come my back dash. Give me armor. Yeah, nice. I had a feeling he was going to go for that. Oh, no. He, you can block the low, but you can't block the triple overhead that comes directly afterwards. All right, dive kick punish. All right, let me go from here. Nice. Okay, good block. Oh, but no punish. Unfortunate. Okay. Let me do this. Let me do this. Oh, man. That is so sick. Look at this. It's not a lot of damage, but what you do get is this setup. <laughs> and just like that, it's just GG's. It's... <laughs> It's so stupid, I swear, man. The amount of cheese that you can get with this Chameleon Natara team is actually ridiculous. I don't know why more people don't use this team. It's actually insane, I swear. Like, I'm being so serious, right? Like, if people actually were to take this team a little bit more serious, if it wasn't for the fact that Sonic Fox did not showcase what's possible with Natara and Chameleon, I feel like nobody would know about this. Man, look at this. I'm really about to win this first game without even, like, doing anything crazy. Yeah, that's a punish. I think this is going to be death, actually. Oh, my God. No, hold up. 2-4. Two, 2-4-2. Four, two, four, two. Oh, my God, man. Match point. That was under 20 seconds. <laughs> he just rage Oh, man. The power of this team is insane. Look at this. Vaternus will survive, she says, right before he rage quits. And then she hits the most amazing pose possible. All right, cool. So we're going on with the final game. This guy's using Johnny Cage Cyrus. This is such an interesting team. I haven't seen this team in like such a long time. Like it's actually been insane. This is like a like day one meta team actually. Now that I'm thinking about it, wake up with something? No, not quite. And go for the low. All right, nice. Poke with something? No, not quite. Come here. Oh no, ladies and gentlemen, this is where it begins and this is where it ends. This is where it begins and then this is where it ends. Look at this. Nothing you could do. Yeah, absolutely nothing you could do in that situation, man. Once you get an idea on how to play with the cameos with Natara, and then... Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on, let me get the Molina in time. Oh, no. This is scary. Oh, good blocks. Okay, let me see if I can do this. All right, let me back that just to create a little bit of space. All right, cool. Let me get the knockdown again. Hopefully, I can get Katana in time. Let me see. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, no. He did not go for a punish. Ladies and gentlemen, he doesn't know that that move is very unsafe on block. If you do 1-2-1-2 one, two, one, two with Natara, he doesn't know what to do. Man, he just frozen. Have you ever seen a Johnny player just frozen like this? Ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. low tier Natara just made a Johnny player so scared to hit a button on block from pressure. You all are seeing this, right? It's not just me seeing this. I think he's going to quit. I'm being very honest. I honestly think he's going to hit the main menu button. I highly doubt he's going to go to the next match. No way he's going to go to the next match. Because he stood there holding that block button for at least 8 seconds. Minimum. Alright, let's see. Let's see what can happen the second game. Maybe jump? <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Okay, man. <laughs> I caught out that jump perfectly. I was like, maybe jump? Ladies and gentlemen. Like I said. Why aren't people talking about this damn team? 
Natara Chameleon is easily one of the most scariest teams in this game that nobody's talking about. Absolutely one of the most scariest. All right, hopefully this is the last game with the uh, the run back with this Omni Man player because uh, I'm gonna add little clips. I'm not necessarily gonna have all of the clips planted right here, but I had just had three matches in a row where all three of them quit directly afterwards. I mean, I'm gonna have two of them because those two were actually like kind of funny. But that Tanya player that I had, no disrespect to them at all. But like, man, playing a character like Tanya and then just having to quit afterwards, it's like, to me, it's just more so like ironic and like funny, if anything. But like, man, I'm trying to show off all these crazy convenient stuff, but I guess these people just don't want me to show it off to you guys for some strange reason. Look at this, man. 465 just for nothing is actually insane. Look at that. 465 into a knockdown setup where I can get anything guaranteed afterwards is actually ridiculous. Like, did you jump? I knew I was gonna get that. Oh, wow, it didn't actually reach in time. That sucks. You backdash? Okay, no. You do this. Oh, no, just barely outspaced me. Okay, that's okay. Oh, the whip punish. I'm gonna do something? Oh, no. Just as I let go of block two, that sucks. Okay. I keep forgetting that I can't jump it. I keep attempting to do it, though, but I don't know why I do. Let me just do this. All right, nice. Let me go for damage, actually, because I do have a lot of bar, and I kind of want to get a lot of damage on this. I want to end it quick, so let me just do this. Overhead option. Nice trade. Let me do this. Yeah, I knew I was going to go for that. Oh, no. Let me see. Nice. <laughs> nice blocks. Oh, no. That sucks. I have to go for the fatal blow because he's not going to have meter in time. I don't know if you all noticed it. In the bottom right corner... He was one hit away from getting his three bars of meter to break. So if I actually would have went for my normal B and B combo, he would have had enough time to get his bar back and break, but I would notice it and I just used my fatal blow instead just to end off that first match. Oh man, so good, so good. All right, let's see, going on to the last potential game, as I said before, so I honestly feel like this guy has potential to make a comeback, like definitely, because Omni-Man has that potential, especially once he gets started, but uh, I'm feeling really confident today, and I highly doubt that I'm going to be losing to this guy. Oh no, hold up, I spoke too soon. <laughs> I spoke a little bit too soon, hold up. This is going to be insane. Hopefully, we can end off this one with a bang. I can say that much, let me see. Okay, hard to blockable. All right, that's fine. Now I'm out of the corner, so that's really good for me. I think this is the first round he's actually taken from me, which is kind of crazy. Let me see. He's probably going to jump. Let me see. Oh, nice. Using the jump kick just to catch me out of the air. Very smart as well. Smart. Okay, he knows. He knows. All right, let me just break this. All right, cool. Let me see. What's it going to be? Let me do punch kick. Nice. Let me go for here. Nice. All right. This is going to be some uh, meterless damage. Nothing too crazy, but it's definitely something uh, noteworthy. Oh my god, he just woke up button? Okay. I'm definitely going to have to work on my meaty timings on that because I messed that up really badly. Let me do this. Okay, nice. Go for my low. Nice. Good blocks. And go for my overhead. He's probably going to break. Yeah, I had a feeling he would. All right, nice. He's probably going to jump. No, it switched to Jade! Just as I called my Melina, are you kidding me? Oh my goodness gracious. That actually screwed me up. I called the Melina and it switched to Jade like the frame I hit the button. Oh man, we're gonna have to go to the last game, aren't we? Wow, okay. There's only one way to end it. And that's to end it with a game three last game situation. Ooh, and I get this Deadly Alliance skin. All right, you know what? I'm feeling myself today. I am feeling myself. This is going to be it right here. No more chances. No more nothing. No more Mr. Nice Guy. We're going to have fun right here. Bam, 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 bam. Go for the knockdown. Normal Blood Sacrifice setup just to keep it safe. Okay, cool. Very smart. Poke. Yep, I had a feeling you were going to do that. Right here. All right, look at this, man. Look at this. Absolutely beautiful stuff right here. <gasps> it didn't kill. 7% left. 
Ooh, right off the air. I just snatched them out of the air like it was nothing, man. Last round, almost full cameo. And I get the Molina is going to jump. Watch this. Maybe. No, not quite. Okay, I tried to barely outspace the 2-2-2 two, two, two string, but it didn't work out in my favor. Very good stuff. Poke. Okay, no. Oh, that's a whiff punish. Give me that. All right, let me go for a setup right here. Because, let me go for here. Bam, bam. Safe jump setup. All right, cool. He did not hit a button, which is good. Watch this. Oh, nice. He outspaced my back, or my down four, rather. Okay, cool. Keeping it safe. Okay, nice. I'm not going to fall for his tricks. Let me poke. Yep. Overhead. Nice. All right, this is going to be a lot of damage. Nothing too crazy, but it's definitely going to be something. Nice. Watch this. Oh, no. And just like that, that's how the cookie crumbles, ladies and gentlemen. Just like that, that is how the cookie crumbles. Just like that, man. Oh, my God. <sighs> GG to this Omni-Man, though. This guy, Homelander 2024. This guy's Omni-Man is good. It's legit, 100%. Just that, unfortunately, my Natara was just much stronger. Hopefully, you guys liked today's video. Please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. If you did, I would really appreciate it. And I will see you all in the next one. Take care.